Weiss I think one of the there's many different angles to it it's really a broad tool set um, so I think the first is our warehouse um, operations piece and we're able to use handheld computers that have barcode scanners built in they have screens and keyboards built in uh, they're quite fabulous little devices that take the processes right to the guys so they are doing real-time transactions uh, my name's Sean and uh, I've worked at Design Ideas for almost four years now. I work out in the warehouse. We used to, like whenever we wanted to uh, get things out of like a uh, non-pick line, which is the stuff that we can't reach personally, we have to have another person grab it on like an order picker or something. Uh, we used to have to like either write it down on a sticky note or something like that to kind of like let him know that, hey, we need this piece. Um, now. It's pretty much in the system. He pulls it. We don't even have to ask for it most of the time. Uh, what we can do with the gun, it reads barcodes. Um, and like I said, if, if I barcode, I scan an item, it'll tell me what the item number is. Uh, say for instance, Tanya MR, that there might be six boxes uh, and say there's 10 items in a box and it'll show me that there's 60 items that I need to put away. I deal with any special issues we have with customers and items that come in. From individual stickering to mass quality inspection to repair and resend of items. In Agility, it's a, essentially like a spreadsheet and it gives me drop downs for um, the items I have, the quantities I want to move, which warehouse I want to move them to. I mean, I can move them five different items to three different warehouses with just a couple of clicks of a button. The other side of it then is the Agility Explorer tool, which a lot of our um, users are using on their desktop and laptop computers, and it puts things into grids so that way we can do things in batch. So whereas before we would go into each individual order, type, change, type, change, enter, you're just seeing all the relevant data right there on screen. I started out actually as a bookkeeper, and I was only going to work 10 or 12 hours a week. And before I even started, the first day I got there, Andy said, how about you work a little bit more? And I've been almost full time <laughs> ever since. Just today, um, we needed to identify all the orders for, uh, that we had in the system for a group of products because we had to make a change to the product and they had to be taken off the orders and some things done to, to change the, the item and then put them back on. And an agility report we created for something else. We found, oh, we can just narrow that down to just those. Uh, exported it to, to Excel. I could group them in order, get all the orders changed very quickly, um, get the items fixed and put the, all the items back onto the orders um, in a fraction of the time that we would have, I mean, just identify, what it would have taken to identify the orders, we probably got them all fixed and changed um, all at the same time, all within that time frame. My name is Tanya and I work in our purchasing department at Design Ideas. So I'm in charge of working with all the factories to get all of the product into our warehouse. I use Agility every day, almost all day. We created a process grid here that allows me to take a customer's order that comes into the system and automatically generate my PO from that. So it saves a lot of time. We have a lot less data entry errors being able to take the OE exactly and turn it into a customer purchase order, so that's great. We also have a grid that allows us, when a shipment comes in, I can receive the entire shipment at one time. I think one of the biggest things is specifically with receiving. When I started here, from the time a shipment arrived at our door, it could be 10 days or more before the merchandise was available for shipment. So that means something is sitting here for 10 days that customers want that we can't ship. Now, Literally today I had one that they brought up and I MR'd while they were standing there. And then two hours later, we're filling it on customer's orders to be able to ship tomorrow. Our turnaround time to our customers, we're giving them the best experience we possibly can.